come along for a sneak peek into my everyday life. Hello cuties, get ready to see real me in action. Join me as I share the ordinary moments that make up my day from soft morning routines to hitting the gym. We'll uncover the beauty in the mundane. So grab your favorite snack, sit back, hydrate yourselves, breathe and let's dive into a day in my life together. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join our awesome community. Let's make the ordinary extraordinary. Good morning. Let's get on with the day. Let's start with the basics. After waking up, I drink a glass of water, eat fruits and then prepare my green tea with lemon juice, squeeze and honey. This routine helps me to collect my thoughts, wake up, come into the reality from the dreamy world and it allows me to start my day on a happy vibe or a happy note. This is peaceful, this is my zen. After preparing the tea, I'll take it to my throne where we'll meditate just to be able to focus more and to be able to like live in present moment and to reduce my overthinking abilities. So I'm taking baby steps there. So I've started three minutes. Earlier I was on two minutes. So gradually I am, you know, increasing the time for the meditation. So from three minutes I'll go above and maybe one day I'll reach above 10 minutes. And it has helped me. I am able to like, you know, focus more and uh, delegate more. So it works charm. But yeah, it takes a time to be there. Welcome to my first productive run of my day where I get my work done, like mostly like checking emails or checking with my teammates checking their work and everything or writing my tasks on the to do list whatever i need to get that done on that day or usually i make the list yesterday like day before in the night so whatever works for me i'll do that this is b and b Time for breakfast. Breakfast and bath. <laughs> it sounded fun when I was editing this video and writing the script. This is the time to fuel your body with the meal. I'll watch my favorite show and relish homemade food. Ah, chef's kiss. After this wonderful meal, I'll freshen up, take a shower and get ready for the day. This step is really important because if I delay it, I'll just feel lazy for the rest of the day. And the weekends are for late showers, so no more lazy anymore. Then I'll do my skincare and skincare has become a lovely habit. I love this part of my day. This is unlike the routine you watch on social media. It's very different. That's what really motivated me to make this video. Each routine, how you go through the day is very personal. And yes, there are benefits of being early riser, getting cold showers, getting your work done in the morning. I have tried those things and it didn't particularly work for me. 
so i figured out a way how to you know balance everything and still make it work for me we shouldn't feel guilty or less productive just because we are not doing things how it works for others or how they preach about it on social media do what works for you and be proud of it i hope it resonates with you and motivates you to build your own routine and don't feel any pressure from social media Comb out these locks and you're ready for the phase 2 of my day. Now we have entered the time of the day where I am most productive. Living in joint family since childhood demands you to find those peaceful pockets of time where you can work without any disturbance. So this particular time frame someone doesn't really need me in the home. so i get all my work done in this time slot so the first phase of the day is over my morning ritual and then some work and bathing and getting myself a coffee i'm ready for my productive phase i think the main trick is to find the time where you feel most productive and really double down on that a whole life i was a deadline person like whenever a deadline comes i'll become alive and do all the work in just one day or the night before the deadline and i've come a long way from that life now i try to distribute my work over a span of time and do a little bit every day and this really helps me you know to cope with the work do a little bit and it doesn't stresses me out in the end that's really changed my life snack time wanted to tell you like why i cut the chips ka packet like with scissors and everything what we do in our household we donate the plastic packets to eco kari so they use the plastic wrappers to make handbags and other goodies like the accessories you can also donate the plastic wrappers and everything to them i'll put the link in the description below if you want to find out what they do and how you can donate you can just go into my description and find the link there this is my snack time i work and i snack before lunch i drink this uh cider vinegar to help the digestion be better and everything so i'm trying it regularly same time maybe at the end of like 20 days i'll see some results i'll make a separate video for that so stay tuned let's get back to work Now another nutritious meal for body and fave TV show for your soul. Enjoy this time. I love this uh, lunch and show combo. We have almost completed half the day. After this, I'll just do some household chores and take a walk in the nature, or just wander around for golden hour prettiness and click pictures of my flowers and show it off on Twitter. <laughs> this is that calm before the chaos time. After wrapping up everything, we'll get ready to slay in gym. Time to go to the gym. I have my outfit ready. So, ta-da! Now for the hairstyle, let me just. I love getting ready for going to gym. Different hairstyles, clothes. It makes me energetic and confident. But before going to gym, I'll just refresh water of my monies. Meet my green friends. This is Jada. This is Manu, and my cute twin monies. They say, "Nice to meet you too." Let them take rest, and we'll just 
swing by gym and come back to meet them again. <laughs> Let's go to the gym. Here I only have warm up videos but I'll tell you what I do after that. After this I'll do uh, 20 minutes cardio and then the exercises whatever day it is. So I think the day I was shooting this it was a chest day. After that I'll uh, again do 20 minutes cardio and I'll just wrap up everything with stretching session and that's it. That's it for the gym. And we'll go back home to relax. Coming back home to get that shake sip and enjoy nature again. <laughs> the bliss of living in Himachal Pradesh. This is it. This is the dream. Coming indoors to relax and mentally prepare to do all the nighttime chores I have to do and then relax again. And here you'll see me making roti. We'll make the roti together. Let's see me in real action. Making that chapati round and inflate it. Yes. I ate dinner, then talked with my family members, wrapped up all my household chores, brushed my teeth and everything. It's done. So we'll enter the blissful phase of a night owl's life. So this time period or this time slot is where I'm most productive with my personal projects like YouTube or maybe freelance work. So I do a lot of my personal projects in this time slot. I think it has become a habit to do work since my college days and it has stayed with me this is the time also like i'm most productive so i have two times i am most productive in afternoon and night time so here we are at finally the day is almost over and i just wanted to sum up my very regular day the only different thing in this day was i somehow and my this thing was paining a lot and finally I had to do the patti thing. In the morning I thought it was just um, a muscle pain but then it got worse and at the end of the day I have to do what it takes to you know soothe it out. So yeah it was fun 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 very fun recording this video. I was very excited and the inspo for this vlog came from i always saw this a uh, day in my life uh while vlogs but i never thought like i'll make one because it's not that aesthetic what you find on social media 
but i was like i want to share it uh, with my viewers making it was a lot of fun i took different angles i even used the ceiling fan and then i hung my one of my tripod on this curtain bar and i was placing uh, my phone everywhere i was just experimenting and experimenting is fun you know that right i hope you like this video i i think sabse zyada mehnat i did this for video because i actually I wrote the shots like the things were the intro shots and all the things I had to cover in the video and also the thumbnail it was a it was like I got the inspiration from that uh, Dhoom Tana ka uh, thumbnail I listen to that song whenever I need energy or uh, <laughs> in my life <laughs> so yeah I hope you appreciate it So like share and subscribe for more content like this see you in the next vlog Time to unwind I'll do some things I love maybe I'll paint call up a friend catch up or paint my nails anything like I'll have to do so to make my brain get tired and let me sleep peacefully for 8 hours. So in this video I am doing the nails and then we'll read a book whatever the current one is a man called Ov then I'll journal so the journal I write my wins for the day my stress and gratitude express my gratitude and after this i'll sleep so that's it sleeping for 8 hours and then waking up again and doing the whole thing again See you in the next vlog. Bye.